Since March 12, 2020, students in Maryland have stayed home at, for virtual learning in response to the coronavirus pandemic. Today, our team is going to take you to an outdoor adventure and show you how learning can be different and fun despite of the pandemic. Now we've arrived at Seneca Creek. As you might know, the entire course of Seneca Creek stretches many miles from the headwaters of the Great Seneca Creek in Damascus through the cities of Gaithersburg, Germantown, and even down through Darnstown to the Potomac River. The majority of Montgomery County's public water supply comes from the WSSC water treatment facilities that lie on the Potomac or Pakistan River. The Potomac facility, the larger of the two, supplies most of the public water in the county. The purpose of today's adventure is to collect macro and microplastic in Montgomery County. As you all know, macroplastic waste is things such as plastic bags, plastic bottles, and plastic wraps. Microplastics are extremely small pieces of plastic that have been broken down to the point that you might not even see them with your naked eye. These microplastics are consumed by fish, macrovertebrae, which has the possibility to cause premature death. This has recently become a major concern as more scientific studies have determined not only the presence of microplastic in the area, but also its ecological effect. After surveying the bank conditions, we start the most important part of our work, collecting microplastic. In order to do that, each team needs to fetch 10 buckets, 10 liters each, to sieve 100 liters in total. The samples collected will then be sent to Montgomery College for analysis. We will then know how much the water in Seneca Creek has been impacted by the microplastics. Plastics are light, durable, and cheap. Therefore, humans use them everywhere. Many of the plastic that we use are not recycled or are not biodegradable. Currently, around a third of plastic packaging worldwide ends up in the environment, and so without significant changes, there will be more plastic by weight than fish in the oceans by 2050.
so now we're finished with today's Humans use plastic every day. Plastic water bottles, utensils, boxes, etc. How much do you know about how much plastics are impacting the environment? Next time, please pay attention to the plastic you use at home. Reduce the usage of plastics and if you do use them, make sure to recycle them. Together we can make our world a better place.